All right, gang, pardon the heater noise. You're just going to have to live with it. It's cold out here. We've got Jackson. Say hi, Jackson. We've got Andy back there. Poor old Andy keeps getting a hold of rough stuff, but we got him squared away. We've got a whole bunch of new plastics. We're going to throw all those on. As soon as we get all those thro thrown on, we'll throw the camera back on. So we get see you guys in just a minute. Well, Andy and I just finished getting the plastics on. We had to use the old fender because a new fender, it just comes back too far back here and it hits the engine. So Andy's going to trim that up and then he'll get that on. But what do you think of that? And the irony here is 777 has been my favorite number for decades and decades. And then he comes up with plastics that have 777 on them. So he's adding all of the other decals. Full decal kit. And he got them cut got them custom made. Do you have one for the front plate too? Yeah. Do you? Yeah. And that will go on the front plate. Wonder if that that can probably just go because it's thick enough. Probably just go right over top of that fox racing. But I'll heat this up and see if I can't get that fox racing off while you're finishing up what you're doing there. So while Andy's hard at work, make sure the bike doesn't tip over. <laughs> Looks pretty good, and he hasn't even heard it run yet, except for on the videos. Yeah, video. yeah. Did it sound a lot better on video than what it did when you first got it? Yeah. And it's not puking oil all over everywhere either, is it? Nope. Oh, I tell you, I couldn't believe. <laughs> and I got rappy cacked for giving the guy that did the work a hard time. I'm like, what? Well, yeah. You know, if this is aggravating, like you said, don't claim you're something that you're not. Right. Yeah, and that's the whole thing. You just don't claim that you're something you know, that you're something that you're not. And you know, yeah, you may have turned a wrench on it, but to call yourself a mechanic and to be a mechanic are two different, entirely different things. So, but I think it looks pretty awesome. That's going to be a fun bike, and it ought to give you quite a bit of good use as long as you keep the rubber side down. You know what that means? Keep the rubber side down. Keep the tires on the ground. <laughs> you dump it or drop it, it's going to be coming back for re more repairs. But I've got all the old parts over here. This cradle right here was the one that, yeah. and you can get a better look at it close up. And you can see. Now, look at these two. Right. And how they're bent. Look at them like this, how they're bent. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Then turn it over. And they just welded washers that's underneath. That's crazy. And the size of the holes was way too big. And there was no way that thing was going to sit on there right or be safe. Right. So whatever kind of wreck that thing was in, it was in a hard wreck for it to bend the forks. Right. What they were doing to the bottoms of the fork tubes, I have no clue. There's no reason at all to beat on the bottom of a fork tube whatsoever. But at any rate, you hang on to that for spare parts, spare kickstand, spare footrest. Yeah. Um, and then the old tires, and you got a spare tube there also, it's for the rear. Okay. Cool. And also one spare seal and one good boot. Alright, cool. So just a few just smattering of extra parts here and there. Alrighty. So tube, tires. <clears throat> foot peg foot peg but I'm going to cut the camera off try my hand at slapping a decal on we'll be right back well there's it's rider and it's owner <laughs> so what do you think Jackson you like it yeah going to have fun riding it Tear some dirt up, huh? Are you going <laughs> to drop it and break anything? No. <laughs> <laughs> Probably, but. Probably, but. That's okay. We'll bring it back to zip. Huh? It can all be fixed. Doesn't matter. It can all be all be fixed.
All right. Well, we'll get you guys loaded up. And Miss Zippo just now getting home at her house. She's going to get ready and come on out here for cool. the weekend. So I hope you guys have a happy Thanksgiving. Thank you. You yeah, too. Yeah, you too. Thank you. And we've got a couple of nice days of weather coming up this weekend. You might be able to get out and tear up some dirt. Yeah. Tear up some grass, huh? Yeah. It's going to be upwards around 50 Take degrees, pants, hopefully. Put my shirt on, put my helmet. That's what they're calling for. Yeah. Helmet? I need new gloves. I already grew out of mine. Did you? Well, it looks like you've got room to still grow on this bike, so you should be able to put a yep. couple scratches in the decals before uh, you outgrow it. Yeah. All right. Well, tell the Zippo Nation bye. Bye. <laughs> see ya. Thank you, Zip. We'll see you guys.